Welcome to Soul to Soul in Three. Our rabbis tell us Ha'avar Ayin, Ha'tid Adayin, Ha'hova Ke'erif Ayin. The past is no longer and the future not yet. And the present is but a fleeting moment, a blink of an eye. So why worry? Although we are meant to think and be concerned about our difficulties in life, but not to worry. Worry is an anxiety. Worry is where we allow our difficulties and sorrows, our problems, to dwell constantly on our mind. And that could be very burdensome and very debilitating. King Solomon says in the book of Proverbs that anxiety in the heart of a person causes dejection, but a good word will turn into joy. And he offers three solutions to be able to deal with difficulty. One, to suppress, two, to ignore, and three, to articulate. Suppress means to cut it down to size. Be realistic about your problem. Is it overwhelming your entire life? Or is it simply relationship related, but not financially? Sometimes we're not as honest as we should be about the problem, and it makes it far bigger than it actually is. So suppress it to its realistic size. And secondly, to ignore. What does ignore mean? Ignore means that you need to not define yourself by the problem. Because if you think about your life, there may be many good things happening. Reasons for joy, reasons for happiness, reasons to be proud of yourself. And think about those things. Replace the negative thoughts with those positive ones. Ignore the problem from time to time. And as you think about the other good stuff in life, it will also shrink your worry. And thirdly, find a good friend. Find somebody who you trust and will not be judgmental of you. Find someone who has compassion and empathy and sicha, articulate it with him. And you will find that the other person doesn't need to have the solution and the answers necessarily. But simply by speaking it over with someone, you'll find that the weight of this difficulty and the heavy load of your problems and your worries will slowly get a little lighter. So I hope that you'll take the, the advice of our rabbis. Daga, don't worry. Be honestly concerned. But with your worries, suppress, ignore, and articulate. And hopefully, it will be easier for you to deal with your tsaras, with the issues that are facing you today. Thank you from soul to soul.